Hey guys, what's going on? I had a great day with Lux Algo today, so I wanted to go through all the trades that I did and talk about what settings I had things on and also just kind of explore Lux Algo in a little bit more detail. So if you're new to the channel and you haven't seen any of my Lux Algo reviews yet, come and check out the article in the description below. It'll take you to this article. It's actually a new one that I'm starting just to try and keep things a bit cleaner, keep things a little bit more concise. Uh, because I think I've covered a lot of the basics of Lux Algo at this point, and I want to kind of document my results a little bit more carefully. So if you come here, there's a link in the article right here, which is to get 30% off the Lux Algo indicators using my special code STA30. If you click on this link, it'll take you to the Lux Algo site. And my recommendation is to purchase probably the three month or the yearly, because one thing that happens here is you only get the 30% off the first billing cycle. So if you want to try it out for a month, that's fine, but just remember that you'll only get 30% off your first month and then you'll have to pay the full price. So I think going through a lot of these trades that you'll see and also you know, looking at my articles and reaching out to me and I can kind of show you what Luxel was about and I think you'll be pretty amazed. I know I'm actually really surprised. I can't believe I've waited this long to try out something that's as well known and used as Lux Algo. And so I'll go through the sentence, I'll go through some of my trades today, I made a ton of money, really happy with what happened today. I documented some of it in my Discord server, but I want to go through and kind of show you the trades and how things went today. Now today, to be fair, was a really good day, and that's partly because it was a very highly trending day. And so Lux Algo is designed, well, one of the parts of Lux Algo is designed to work really well when the market's trending, and that's what I used today, and I think that's why I had such good results. So let's have a look at some of the trades today and talk through them and show you on the actual Lux Algo markup. So let's start with just showing you what my settings are. Everybody always wants to know this. They always experiment with their own settings. This is the one I've found over the last few weeks has worked best for me in trending markets. So let's just quickly go through it. You can see what we have here, but if we double click on here, you get the menu. So basically in a trending market, you want the confirmation, which is what I have. I set the sensitivity to 12, which is just an arbitrary number that I found works quite well for me. I don't know if it matters that much. I messed around with the autopilot for a while, but changed that and I don't really use the autopilot anymore. Then all I have is the reversal zones and the smart trail. And honestly, the reversal zones are not coming into play that much for me at the moment. And so those are the simple settings. And that's what's crazy about this is it's super powerful. There's all these different settings, but basically I'm just setting it to those two things. Smart trail, confirmation, sensitivity to 12, and the reversal zones a little bit too. So, a couple of other things to basically mention. I also only take signals that fall into the category of following the trend, right? So, for example, I'll try and find one. It was kind of hard today to find anything that, that didn't really work, but here's one that didn't work. I never took this one. And the reason I didn't take it is it was signaling an up buy thing right here but you can see the smart trail marked in red this is like a trailing resistance you know we're below that and it's red so why take stuff that's going against the trend and you can see this is on the one minute chart i'm only ever trading spy by the way with this this is the one minute chart and you can see this really didn't, didn't do much at all it kind of failed so i ignored this signal for those reasons because one we're below the smart trail and it's red and we want to really go with the, with the trend. So that's why I ignored that. So that's one of the criteria that I use to exclude these things. Now there is something you can do in Lux Algo, which is really simple, is you can go to the preset filters and you can get rid of any signals that are not going with the trend. So you can get rid of the, these like that. So if we click on this one and click here and the signals that don't go with the trend disappear. And so you're left with just the signals that uh, are going with, with the trend. In general so you can see kind of how that works so that's a simple trick you can use so this was the start of the day you can see we had a downtrend pretty much all day right until towards the close here again this is spy one minute chart so I took some screenshots this was my day today spy all of them spy 2500 bucks profit which is awesome I can use some of that to go towards trading futures with data traders so that'll be good I'm trying to put that into more passive income use and so you can see the, the trades that I did here, I do zero DTE generally. And so except when it gets towards the end of the day, then I don't do zero DTE, but generally I do zero DTE spy. And you can see that it's May the 12th today. And I did mainly puts today. I did one call at the end of the day, but the other three were puts right here. 
So let's start with the first trade, which was the biggest winner of the day. It was actually also uh, one of the fastest as well. So some of these trades take 10 minutes, 20 minutes, sometimes they take three minutes. So this one wasn't the wasn't the uh, slowest one. And I did alert as I was doing it in the Discord, which I can show you and I'll also show you the trade. So here's the snapshot from the Discord. Let me just close this down. Which is cool. The reason I'm doing it in the Discord is partly because it's fun to share the sentence and stuff that I'm doing with other people because a lot of you guys have uh, looks all going there already. But also because it's a good timestamp thing for these types of videos and showing you know actual real user trades as well. So it's pretty pretty helpful. So this is in Central Time, 10.14, so let's go and look at the Lux Algo. I think it was 10.14. It was this one right here. So I'm just going to center that and zoom in on the 10.14, which is over here. Can I make that bigger? So you can see how fast this signal was right here. I think Lance from Theta Traders and also Sidekick Traders was also jumping in this one as well but it's crazy we got 40 percent in like two minutes okay so the thought process here was this arrow came on and i got, got alerted and we're in this candle right here so because we're basically had this really really bearish candle and the fact that we're below the smart trail and the general trend of the market is down today i figured it'd be pretty smart to jump in now there was a moment here where i was a bit worried that this level of support might hold and we would just immediately reverse back up. So that was a little bit like, ah, oh, maybe this isn't gonna work. But luckily it did actually, we had like one candle and then we had this giant, <laughs> giant red candle. And I took profits pretty much immediately as we hit the reversal zone in the green here. So like right here. So the reversal zones can be useful for that because if you're up 40% and you hit a reversal zone, it's probably a good idea within a couple of minutes to take profits. And that's what I did. And so you can see that was this one. I was in with a larger than usual position size. Sometimes I go a bit bigger, uh, but today it was quite aggressive overall, I'd say, um, especially since it's kind of busy. So I got 0.67 on the 411 puts, zero DTE. Uh, I apologize because I knew like this was gonna move fast. Um, I'm trying to get better. And then just uh, two minutes later, I took profits at 0.94. So 0.67 to 0.94, so 40% in two minutes so not ideal if you're trying to have people like follow your trades but that's not really the full goal here is like i'm testing lux algo and kind of helping people learn like what what's working for me kind of thing so that was the first trade of the day this did continue down and lux algo actually suggested taking profits further down on this little cross right here but honestly with with theta decay and the fact that you're in this for another 10 minutes probably wasn't super worth it i think taking profits quickly on this drop it was probably the right thing to do uh, in this case. You can see all these signals pretty much work today. <laughs> really good. Anyway, another quick trade I did was the 412 puts, right? So, yeah, the 412 puts. One of the guys in the Discord conveniently plots these for me sometimes when he's around, which is awesome. So you can see the plot here. So uh, this is 12.07 Eastern, so 11 o'clock my time. I'll just pull up real quick on, um, yeah, it was this one. So it was the next signal, basically. Again, we had the, the, the smart trail change, change into red. We had a downwards arrow, so I jumped in on this one and wrote it down here. So you can see that. And again, I was a little bit nervous here. It seemed like we were finding support and then it finally broke. Again, took profits down here. So you can see this right here, 410-ish. Let's pull this up. So go back to here. Yeah, so immediately on this drop, again, using the reversal, the green reversal thing as a potential um, take profit area, right? So uh, I always take profit too early. You can see this thing just kept going all the way down, all the way down here, uh, but you know, you can't time everything perfectly. I think that's where you, like using Lux Algo as a tool and not just blindly following it. Sure, in this case it could have made a ton more profits, but also in other cases it could have reversed heavily against me. So generally I'm aiming for anywhere between 20 and 40%. If I can get it fairly quickly with Lux Algo signals, I'll take it and, and run for the hills. 
So hopefully that's useful. Let's see this one. Let's see. So these were the 414 puts at 1118. So let's see, I think I must have re-entered 1118. Hmm, not sure what that one's about. Did I get that wrong? Was it? Hmm, not sure what's going on with that. Let's see. So we had some sideways action. Is that what 1118 looks like? Did I? Did I enter this for a different reason? Oh, maybe it's because I felt it was retest in this, yeah. So because I, I did so many trades today, I lose track. So anyway, took another trade there. And then at the end of the day, I did the first calls. I didn't really talk about it in the Discord, just because I've been busy and running around. I want to make sure when I'm telling people I'm doing things, in case they end up copying me, that I'm available to give full commentary and things as, as we go. So. Here was the last trade of the day. Try and get rid of all these pop-ups. So we had a nice trend reversal at the end of the day today. Going into the close. You can see we got this nice nice buy signal. We had a trend change to the blue, which is the bullish, the bullish uh, trend change. And so I jumped in and rode this up a little bit and, and got a little bit more money from this thing. So it was, it was pretty good. That was the four living calls. She went pretty well, pretty well. And you can see this thing, of course, went all the way up here, uh, all the way up into the close. Pretty nice. So yeah, overall, like this has been an amazing week for Luxelgo, and it continues to totally impress me. And part of that, yep, trending market. Let's see how it does when we really start to range again. But overall, I'm really, I'm really impressed with this. It's a lot of fun. There's plenty of signals. You can tailor it to what you want it to be. There's tons of other features. Again, I keep saying I'm going to go through the other features. The problem is the ones I'm using are working so well, I just have to tell you guys about them every day. Anyway, come and check out the review. It's a revised review. Again, you can get the 30% off Lux Algo, which means you're only paying $100 for three months, which is ridiculous because if you're using a, even if you're using a few hundred dollar position with options and timing these trades properly, it's like nothing, you know, 100 bucks is pretty much nothing for this. And so it's definitely worth checking that out. In here I'm putting the videos down the bottom again. I'm trying to keep it more orientated towards results though. So you can see most of these are my result videos. The one you're watching right now is going to go in here obviously as well because it's probably the biggest, well it is the biggest results I've had from Lux Algo. Um, yeah, so hopefully this is helpful. I think it's something I wish I'd seen years ago so I could be trading Lux Algo for the last few years certainly simplifies my life. If you're looking for some support and help with this Lance and I are in Sidekick Traders. I'll leave a link for a three-day trial for that. We are trading a lot of stuff but we're also taking Lux Algo trades so we talk about this type of stuff and you can kind of quiz us and follow along if you want and see if, if Lux Algo might be something that you want to, to try based on on our discussions and these videos and things. So anyway, hopefully it's helpful and I'll talk to you guys in the next video.